I get it. Most of you are trying to get that female attention. You're not getting it. You're the one just giving it out. So I want to flip the script. I want it to be dished out to you. And to do that, I need you to start with number one. I need you to have unbreakable confidence. Now there's two ways to do this. The, the first way is the way you should go, is, which is it'll be through merit. Now you could fake it till you make it, which it, it does work. But at the end of the day, if you want to have unbreakable confidence and no one can break down, you need to build it through merit, through competence. Be great at something. And I've told you this before, pick anything. I don't care what it is, business, school, athletics. Pick something and then work. Like work like no one else, two, three times a day, put in the hours, Work on that one thing, become great at that one thing, and you'll notice the confidence that you're going to feel. And when you reach the top of that designated field, bro, women will flock to you. Now, the second way, it's kind of like a, like a hack. It's more of an instant thing. See, the merit one, it's going to take time. It's not going to be a month, two months. It could be a year, two, three, five years. The second way is instant. Make yourself bigger. If you want immediate attention from women in any room you are, you have to appear bigger. And that means you want to stand taller. Your head has to be over your spine. Your chest has to be out. Your chin needs to be upwards. You should be standing in a shoulder width stance. This gives you your most dominant frame, whereas when you stand in a room full of weak men, you'll stand out. Two, smell memorable. This is so crucial, boys. You have to understand that your olfactory bulb is one of the most powerful triggers that a woman can have. And if when she meets you, you leave her with some, something positive, which is your smell, I promise you, she won't forget that. And anytime she smells it, she's going to attribute it to that positive interaction, which is associated to you and your name. And that's going to trigger her arousal. Smelling good is a cheat, a hack for so many men. The problem is, I would say maybe 10% take advantage of it. That means 90% of you have heard this and maybe put it into practice once or twice in your life, but you're not doing it on a daily basis. You're not doing it day in and day out. And that's the thing. You have to always be ready. You never know when you're going to see a girl, think she's beautiful, and you're going to have to deploy that. That's why you want to stay prepared. And the only way to do that is you need the right fragrances for every situation. And that's where Santa Lucia has you covered. Yo, our new fragrance set, which is the day and the night set, was specifically designed for this. I wanted you to have two simple fragrances. The one that you can wear any time in the day and one that you can wear any time in the night and have you set. Basically, with these two fragrances, you're good to go. With these two fragrances, you can go to any situation and know you're gonna be the best smelled guy in the room and it's perfect for that occasion. So I'm gonna hook it up. If you guys wanna check it out, you can buy both fragrances in a bundle right now, but I'm gonna spice it up. We have our travel sets, which it's all sold out. We only have three colors left, which is perfect for this offer because I'm going to give you three of those. That's a $150 offer. They're going to be pre-filled with our dark collection. So in reality, when you buy the bundle today, you're going to get $150 worth of free fragrances. In total, you're going to have five different scents, and now you're going to be ready for anything. You're going to be ready for anything, and you're going to smell like the man. If you guys want to check it out, it'll be linked down below. Number three you approach. See, most of you probably think that just because she's beautiful, she gets approached 24-7. You're probably wrong. You don't understand this, but beautiful women, the same way you think, man, she probably gets approached all the time, other men are thinking the same thing and they're not doing so. So at the end of the day, she probably gets approached once or twice a month or at a minimal rate in person because she's so beautiful. Now, through DMs, anybody can slide in through DMs. But in person, I guarantee you, she's not getting approached all that often, meaning that if you have the balls to do so, you're going to leave a memorable moment in her mind that she won't forget, especially if you do it smooth. Don't, don't be overly lovey or overly invested. Don't tell her, oh my God, you're the most beautiful girl I've ever seen. I'd love to take, no, be chill about it. You know, hey, my name is blank. I'd love to take you out or I find you interested. I'd love to get to know you more. Can I have your number? Super chill, super relaxed. It doesn't look like you're super invested, which makes it even better. I promise you, she won't stop thinking about you. Four, dress well. If you want woman's attention, you have to dress well. And, and this is the reason. You have to understand that when a woman's analyzing you as a potential mate, they're not just see the, the reason why they're seeing your money and your status and all this matters is because they're also thinking, I got to show this guy to my friends. I got to show up with this guy to family events. 
to my work events. If she doesn't see you as the guy that she'd be proud to, to be her protector, her provider, to be the face of the relationship, she's basically drawing it up in her mind. She's thinking about the wedding and the kids. And if you're not that guy, she ain't going to be giving you any attention. You have to dress for success. You have to look good always. When you do, I promise you, you stand out. Because you go into any room, most guys are dressed up par. You be the guy that dresses up to the next level, you're the one getting the attention. You're the one where all the girls are now daydreaming. Which ultimately rolls me to number five. Just stop trying to get them to notice you. All of this works, but at the end of the day, you should be working on yourself. If you're just wasting your time 24 seven and trying to figure out and hack the system to figure out how to get girls to notice you, yeah, you might be good at getting initial reactions, right? You might be good at getting even maybe one night stands. You won't be good at being able to keep women, especially beautiful women. You won't be able to keep them because you haven't built yourself up to be that guy. Again, you want to have that unbreakable confidence. Remember my first tip that there were two routes? I would love to know how many of you chose the easy route. How many said, I'm just going to use this tip? I guarantee you, less than 5% of you said, whoa, the merit route, that's the route I want to take. Whoever of you took that route that is still watching this video, you guys are the actual winners. You guys are the actual winners because at the end of the day, the best way to get female attention is by stopping trying to get female attention and fully, wholly working on yourself as a man to become the best version of yourself.